2018, everybody! Woo! Did they get that? Woo! Okay, that's better. Sorry, camera froze up. Well, today I'm going to be taking a look at my Adventures collection. And some comparisons back there with the take-alongs. Or taking plays. To be honest, I can never remember. Oh, well. Let's start with the number one engine. Thomas! Well, his face is pretty good. The buffers could be colored. It's a good side. I like, I think the boiler could have been, this part of the boiler, the square part could have been squashed down a bit. And this could have been raised up the dome and the cap could too. Um, the coal is flat. I think. Nope, never mind. Uh, sorry. Um, buffers again. Could have been better. Could have had more black back lining too. Same thing on the other side. Oh. Well, um, you saw Thomas right here. You see him? You see him? No, you don't. Let's get my old take along Thomas in here. Um, well, take along. It didn't have a white foot plate. It's, I painted that on. I know, not my greatest work, but um, this Thomas has a lot more memorable one. And this one's kind of like bland. This one's think is better because it's like skinnier if it was just a little thicker um they if they had made the cab a little bit taller they could have been able to cut through there like the take along thomas did um the face i guess you could say take along thomas's face is more like the promo pictures and this new thomas's face is cgi so Put them back here. Let's take a look at my next one that I have, which is Henry. Who doesn't love Henry, right? Well, Henry, um, his tender. That's where I start to come to it. Ouch. Well, his tender, it's the wrong shape. So, yeah, because I'm just going to bring in the take along Henry's tender right now. See how take along says? That's how this one should be, well, because, well, it's just how it should work, how it should look, because Henry has a different tender, I don't know why, but, um, <clears throat> the rest of him, except for the pistons right here on this side, is actually pretty good. Let's take a look at the face. Well, that's a peculiar one. Is Henry crooked to you right now? I want to see how that works. Well, not really, but... Okay, anyway. Well, his buffers could have been colored in. And if you saw... Oh, they forgot a detail on Thomas. Because I was going to do a quick comparison to Thomas right now, but... See how Gordon, they had the little front things coming down? Thomas has those too, but they didn't even mold that, so... But you see, they could have just easily done the same thing, just a lot shorter with Henry. And Henry is the only one here, I believe, with lamp irons. So I'd say if they, oh, if only they were colored, Henry would be the most accurate. Well, let's get this take along Henry up here. It's the talking version because I didn't. Uh, I was going to. I didn't have a Henry for a long, long time. I don't know why, but. I painted the foot plate, yeah, yeah. Um, his pistons are colored, so, yeah, um, they could have added, well, they could have molded the silver handrail, and the domes could have been a bit larger. Yeah, but, for some reason they did that on Thomas, they, <sighs> take along Henry and Adventures Thomas have the same thing, and so does Adventures Henry, but, yeah, I don't mind it. The coal could look like this on there because Henry's is just a couple bumps, but mostly flat. So let's take a look at Adventures Gordon next. Sorry, just adjusting my line. Okay, um, Gordon, he does have the right tender. I wish all the ten Gordon's tender was a little bit longer though, because it looks like they just did James's tender and painted it blue with a number four. And you know, Gordon's colors. The Gordon colored James's tender, but um, 
This is wrong with all of my Adventures models. If they made it a little bit longer, they could have fit through wheels, which is how they really are. But, um, yeah, you had to paint those windows on Gordon. That's just too small of a space. But, yeah, the cab could have been raised up a little. Not a lot, like the take-along Gordon, but... Yeah, I'm not going to do a comparison to him now. Cause, well, I painted him up and then I repainted him back to his original colors. But yeah, the stripes are good. Ow, my hand. Ugh, sorry, I've been holding it with my right hand and I got hand crap. So, uh, <laughs> um, Gordon has the front thing, so I cut him and, and his puffers. I like how they didn't just circle him, like... Every other set of buffers is, except for Shima. But, yeah, they actually old them and took time into that. But his pistons could have been colored, once again. Sorry if the camera's been shaky. Um, This is really long. It's on low charge. So I'll probably finish up with James and show you the rest in part two. So this is James. I think he's really accurate because he has the front things, too. A little longer, but he has the longest foot plate sticking out there. Because it's not very long in the rest of them. But he doesn't have pist he doesn't have pistons to be colored in. But I like how they didn't just make the mistake of putting gray wheels on him like Bachman did. But he could have had three wheels on the tender. The five is, I think, is really good on him. Once again, just bumps. Just little bumps. And the dome could have been raised up a little because... Even if you had the crappiest toy of James, even they have the dome, right? But they could easily cut that sp space out. Yeah, I think it, I think it would have been really cool if they it, were able to give these guys, like, full cabs. Hopefully they do, like, a 2.5 version of them. But um, take along, James, right up here. Um, I painted him, too, and then scrubbed off. I didn't repaint him like I did to Gordon, but... Um, He's good, because the box, his little box thing, I don't know what to call it, but yeah, that was pretty, I think, um, the Adventures James had it taller, but see, every other James has it cut out right here, so, so you might as well do that with normal James, but, um, his number five, it's good, you know, but his face, I absolutely love that face a lot. A lot more because well it just looks cute you know James is a cute engine so it's probably why it's my favorite but anyway I'm gonna go before they cut me off so bye guys see you in the second video of 2018 bye